before the game. The atmosphere inside the King Power is absolutely electrifying, Dan. Just listen to that noise. There's Wes Morgan at the head of the Leicester City line. What a big returning he is for Leicester City tonight. The atmosphere absolutely buzzing inside the stadium. It's New Year's Eve and the 4th of July rolled into one of the King Power Stadium and Leicester City hope that their performance can be as explosive as the introduction of the two teams here onto the field. Wes Morgan's return after six games out is huge for Leicester. The captain lines up alongside Ben Luan at centre-back with Robert Hoot suspended. Danny Trinkwater returns in midfield after a rest at the weekend. Ten of this 11 started the first leg in Madrid. Shinji Okazaki keeps his place. He was replaced at half-time in the Calderon by Andy King. And Didi and Vardy are a booking away from a suspension. Diego Simeone left out the likes of Griezmann, Savic, Koke and Sal Niguez at the weekend, but they all return tonight. It's essentially the tried and trusted unit back together. Gabby, the captain, is also back after a day off against Osasuna. Jose Jimenez starts in midfield. There's no place in the starting lineup for either Torres or Gamero. Both are on the bench. It's a more defensive Atletico tonight. It's neatly taken down by Koke. Now here's Antoine Griezmann. Yannick Carrasco, Griezmann's carried on the run, sliding interception by Simpson. The corner to Atletico Madrid, but they've got to keep their wits about them at the back, Leicester. They've just got him behind there, Griezmann, nobody picking him up. You can see exactly what Carrasco wants to do, the reverse pass into Griezmann. And Mark Albrighton, Mahrez is a bit more central. Jamie Vardy gets his head up and looks for Shinji Okazaki, who is running in a pace. It's the best opportunity that Leicester City have managed to create so far. Well, man has been looking for the board, found himself in a fantastic position. Just looking, he's in between the lines there. Great first touch, and on the way of the pass, the Vardy was brilliant. He's seen Okazaki, went with his right foot, could he have gone with his left? Yes, he probably could have. Good, good opportunity there for Leicester City. It's quite possibly the first thing in the Leicester players as each minute ticks by. There's Yannick Carrasco, now Koke. Carrasco has made the run for the middle. One of the important touches that was from Morgan. Would have been clean through on Schmeichel had the captain not got there. Felipe Luis with the ball in. And then powered down and powered in by Sal Miguez. And it's the away goal that Leicester City simply couldn't concede. Yeah, you said Fletcher was a great block from Morgan in the first place. Carrasco would have been in. See the run from Carrasco, but the captain with a good, strong right foot. And then Sal on the back post. It's Felipe Luiz. Great ball in, and I've got to say, Fletch, what a fantastic header. His neck muscles, the power, the zip off the surface. Great header from Sal. Look at the focus. It's a great header, angle to that far corner. Brilliant finish. Sal gets a sixth goal of the season, the third one he scored in the Champions League. He got one in the last 16 against Bayer Leverkusen. Scored in the semi final last season against Bayern Munich. Mares, Jimenez with a foot in, and then the counter attack involving Griezmann. Now Gabby. Carrasco had made a really good run for the middle, had the Griezmann been able to spot him. Morgan in with the challenge, didn't get there. Here is Yannick Carrasco. Sal Miguez is up there with him. Took it early as well, and Schmeichel was aware just how much that ball was curling on its way to him. Yeah, coming from that right hand side, Sal himself in a good position on his left there to take the Leicester corner. Sal Miguez with an important header in his own box this time. All Brighton with another opportunity. 
Jimenez is in the middle this time, and then Riyad Mahrez came through a crowd, and Jan Oblak was in the right place behind the players. Yeah, he just wanted that to fall onto his left, but good communication, he obviously called for it. Just seemed to roll down his shin as he hits it, straight into the arms of Oblak. Koke, Carrasco has made the run, he's playing down the left one minute and down the right the next, he's up there on his own though. Through the challenge of Ben Luan and he's still going here, Yannick Carrasco, he's showing his strength. Kasper Schmeichel in the end had to go out there and deal with it for Leicester. Look at this challenge on Kasper Schmeichel on Yannick Carrasco a couple of minutes ago, Robbie, at the other end. Yeah, he seemed to take Carrasco's leg first, his left leg, just watch it there. Then he won the ball. You've got to say, penalty. Oh! Gabby to Griezmann. He's got that bit of acceleration now, we see it. And from Griezmann running through Leicester. Here's Griezmann still, looking to tee up Carrasco. Paul Brighton just lent on him. The Italian referee says no penalty, and all Brighton clears it, but that's Antoine Griezmann. And yeah, Carrasco, as you see here, poor from Fuchs there. Drinkwater can't catch him, and then the reverse pass there. Carrasco, just don't think he was going, going to get on the end of it. Good defender from all Brighton, not a penalty for me. Well, the lads disagree. Sent forward by Simpson. Flicked on his Chilwell with a chance. Struck it sweetly, Chilwell, but couldn't keep it down. Yeah, he watches the ball. Decent technique on his left foot, just a fraction too high. But I think the plan will be now for Leicester to knock the long ball, get Azua, Vardy, you know, get the wing backs. Chip up towards Azua. Godin behind him, and Mares. All Brighton in towards Vardy. It will fall here for Ben Chilwell. And then it's in, and Leicester City get a lifeline through Vardy. His second goal in the Champions League, and maybe there is still hope for Leicester. Well, there is still hope. Half an hour to try and get two more. They're putting long balls in. You know, this time it's all Brighton from a decent angle. Vardy tried to win the first, then Chilwell on his left foot. Good block, and this leave of Vardy, the right man at the, right the right time. Decent finish, I have three bodies in front of him. He lifts it into the roof of the net. Still half an hour to go. Jamie Vardy's 14th goal of the season, his eighth goal of his last 11. Christian Fuchs. With another one of these long throws, they've got a show to aim at now as well. Morgan's in the mix. A show with a chance! Vital clearance! I think it's Hernandez, a substitute. The ball falls to a show. It looked like it was going in, the substitute blocks it. Sal with a block that time, but this time it was her. Hernandez, a substitute, they won the second ball. It's a clean strike from a show. Very important block. In that Atletico Madrid technical area, he's been so much more animated the last ten minutes or so. Now this long ball finds Mares, he's looking to tee up Jamie Vardy! Savage this time with the block. That's twice in the last couple of minutes that Atletico Madrid... Have... You see the pullback, Vardy doesn't clean, strike it cleanly. Just see their hit into the ground. Look like he was good in that far corner. So committing bodies one way, can come back the other and maybe exploit some space. Here's all Brighton. Riyad Mahrez. In towards Vardy with a flick and through to Oblak. Very open game now. Probably suit both sides, a counter attack. Mahrez there with the ball into the box, Vardy. No back heel. Game's wide open now. There's almost a hush descended over the stadium. 
It's Mores! And it didn't quite come down quickly enough. They're trying to go for the smallest man in the wall. Koke got it over him, but he just couldn't get it down. Joe just nudged him out of the way. 